In this 60 second health and social care, we're going to look at osmoregulation. Osmoregulation maintains the balance of water and solutes, such as salts, in the blood and tissues to ensure that cells function properly. This is achieved through mechanisms involving the hypothalamus, kidneys and hormones like antidiuretic hormone known as ADH. The hypothalamus detects if blood is too concentrated or too diluted and initiates the appropriate responses. If the blood is too concentrated, this is due to low water levels. The hypothalamus signals the pituitary gland to release ADH, which acts on the kidneys, making them reabsorb more water. Urine output is reduced and concentrated and fluid balance returns to normal, which switches off the ADH. In comparison, if the blood is too diluted, this is due to high water levels. The hypothalamus will signal the pituitary gland to reduce or stop the release of ADH, meaning the kidneys reabsorb less water. As a result, more water is excreted in larger volumes of dilute urine, helping to restore the balance of water and solutes in the blood.